friends, welcome back. Today, our adventure begins beachside at a local little gas station slash convenience store where they claim they have a leak somewhere by the coffee machine. I can't probably do very much talking. Pay attention and let's go in. Did you see that? Like a flexible line, water supply line to that coffee maker blew out. That's one of the reasons why as a plumber, I don't use those flexible lines because this is the kind of crap that happens. Now it's got one in its three eighths. It's going into the shut off valve back up underneath the cabinet. And I'll show that to you. The line that's going into the back of the coffee pot is a little bit different. So we're gonna have to figure out what we need to do. Uh, catch up to you when we get back in there. So I gotta find a flared fitting. And the other line that was cut off back in there is three eighths, just to go to regular angle stop. I don't know if I have anything like that. I'm gonna have to try to dig around. If not, I'll have to call and get some parts. Hmm. My intentions are not to put a flexible line like this back in, especially when it's flared. There's something similar to that coming out of the back of that coffee pot, coffee maker. It's the flared end. We don't want that. So this might work out perfect if this half inch, whatever this is, goes in the back coffee maker and we can hook up our 3 8 line. Just use regular nuts to go back on there. Let's go see if we can get that other fitting off the back of the coffee pot. Oh, she's coming off.
Yes. Get a net on there. And a ferrule. Oops. I'm up underneath the cabinet there, so this is difficult. And then we need to hook it on to right there. Time to turn this on and see if we got any leak going on. going to do it for this one thanks so much for hanging out and watching the video not exactly the most exciting of repairs and i by no means i'm going to claim that i am good at working on professional grade restaurant equipment we just happen to get lucky and have the proper fitting on the van to make it work there's no rigging when it comes to being a plumber we're professional and that's what we do handymen do their thing and they do a good job but we do not splice things together like that old line that i pulled out of there that ended up blowing out and these people trust our name and our works that's why they called us and success on these cold brisk mornings people come into the store and enjoy a nice hot cup of coffee got any questions or comments leave them down below and don't forget to keep plumbing